Fuck you! Fuck you, game! That's it, I'm, I'm quitting. I'm rage quitting that. I, I, must, I must have done just at the end. I guess we'll roll something else. Scout, Scout's a slippery little eel. You'll, you always lose against, uh... Oh yeah, they, you also have this, uh, half Satoshi, which is basically, uh... Uh, it'll, it'll, when you kill someone, it'll restore you to 100% health. However, if you bring it out, you can't put it back in until you kill someone. Just kind of a fun little melee. Uh, you also get the disciplinary action, which is also kind of fun. So if I find one of my allies... That's not an ally. Well, I'll just wait for him to land. That, that works for me, too. Um, the, the best part is, I've, I, found, I found that guy because of his, uh... The hell? He's just kind of chilling. He's a sad sniper. Uh, so y what you can do is you can hit an ally with this, and they'll g they'll move faster. So here, go heavy. You'll move faster too. So you know I'm kind of helping this heavy stay alive, I guess. Get in there, spy. <laughs> get in there, and get burned by the pyro. Um. My, my problem with this is you're basically being kind of fucking useless because uh, you have your own movement mechanic for basically rocket like you can rocket jump around uh, And that, that's your thing like you're so, why, I, why are you not rocket jumping around is the question um, The medic max every every class that's worthwhile can either has a movement mechanic of their own or You know like th this heavy could wear his gloves right now but, you know, I like to kind of ride and crap him. It's, it's really erotic. Just kind of hit everybody. It's, 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 it's utterly useless. It's basically it. Like, as I said, every class is either really fast... ...or I just got stabbed for the second time. Anyways, let's, let's, let's de-equip that shit, because I'm really getting distracted by that. We're gonna, we're gonna put in the half, half Satoshi or whatever it is now. Which is a fun melee. Um... Yeah, so every class worthwhile has... Has has their own mechanic, so it doesn't even matter. You know, I saw him here somewhere. Where is he? Saw you somewhere, Pyro. Fire, fire, fire! And I got him. Oh God. <laughs> that, that health is really saved my ass right now. I won't even. I won't even joke. Um, okay, that's enough of him. Medic, can you heal me? No. Okay, I guess I'll just uh, do this shit on my own. I have um, have to tell she's like it's just it's for fun. That's that's all it is. Normally you'll probably be running the escape plan or equalizer or something. Anyways, uh, so yeah, so scouts scouts are slippery eels. You can wait for them to do to land. And then take your shot. Uh, it's a totally feasible strategy. And that pyro is the most oblivious I've ever seen. I got that guy at least. You know, if he hadn't grabbed that ammo, I wouldn't have gotten him. That's how I knew. <laughs> I'm enjoying this. Oh, sh oh, wait. Oh, what? I brought it out and I was able to bring it back in. How? I think there must be some kind of like, uh, I guess if you attack with it once. There we go. We got the medic. And honestly, that, sa that health is really saving me. I wanna, I wanna, I wanna Zatoshi someone. That's gonna be fun. Hello, Pyro. Damn it. Probably not the, probably not the best thing to, to try and, try and Samurai Sword to, to death. Um, actually, I, I really like that melee weapon. I should really run that on my soldier more often. Uh, against other soldiers, it's, uh, soldier battles can be really epic. They can be like, like, uh, it depends on the skill level of both the soldiers, but they can be actually a lot of fun, because, uh, you have, like, one, uh, one, like, one so like, you try and get them into the air, and then you try and do an air shot, which is basically, you know, you kind of just, uh, get them into the air, and then you hit them in the air. Uh, I'm not too good at that. I do that very sparsely. Uh, as I said, not a class I particularly play very often. Um, so, that's it for that. 
Um, and also you have the shotgun and the secondary soldier doing a lot of fun. The melee doesn't really come into play as much. Um, when the equalizer was at its fullest, it w could be used as basically like a last ditch effort to kill him. Because uh, the uh, pre pre nerf uh, equalizer uh, was was actually insane because you got the speed and the damage buff, so you could basically just run right up to them at scout speeds and just like and hit him once and then they would die. Um, and that's why it got nerfed, obviously. That's uh, that's that's obviously always fun, and this team just emptied. Seems to happen a lot. Um, it's it, and yeah, they nerfed it like ten times. So you know now you can just kind of run this. So now I can't. Yeah, yeah, that's that's what it takes. And then yeah, when it when it's fully out, if I do. That's interesting. Like if I do this, I can bring it. I can quickly bring it back in. So when it's fully out, I can't bring it back out. That's interesting stuff. Okay, I switched classes real quick because I was about to burn to death. That was not going to be fun. Oh, he had, he, had, uh, he had a crit, so that's okay. Um, against pyros? Pyros aren't actually a huge threat. You, you kill them anyways. Uh, the main problem is with their reflecting. Um, and the reflecting can fuck you because it's basically a mini crit. Uh, if they get reflect reflect off, and uh, now the thing about reflecting is it's extremely difficult to do. Um, it's difficult to the point where pyros themselves cannot do it reliably at all, um, which is why you see a lot of them. They're like whenever you face if you've ever played soldier, you're gonna notice whenever you face something against pyro, they're gonna go for anticipating your rocket attacks, not actually reflecting them directly. Um, that's kind of how they roll with it. Uh, and, and the difference between that is, is basically, they see you and they think you're going to rocket them. Because especially at close range, that you can't time it. You can time it from long range, you can't time it from, from short range. Oh, that was a guy. You cannot time it from short range at all. Uh, and so they're going to just go for it. They're going to spam it, basically. Because, you know, they think you're going to die. So, you know, and it works, because they, they sometimes will reflect the rocket, and, and, and then they get a kill out of it, so... You know, it's, it's kudos for them for that. Um, I don't really know why I keep seeing people doing weird weird shit all the time, and now I just got random critted. Fun stuff. Um, yeah, Soldier is the master of crits. Uh, oh, do, oh, he got a... He, get, he did get a... He did get a... Uh, he did get a kill with that, and he's happy about it. Um... And with that being said, yeah, all you have to do is when you see a pyro and your first instinct is to shoot. Oh, why do my crits never hit anything? Sad about that. <laughs> I like watching those guys, those two go at it. And try and get this. What? This is like the most fucked up server I've ever been on. Since I can't actually hit this this scout directly with uh, any any rockets, uh, I'm just gonna try and shotgun him basically. And we actually did we actually did get this. There we go, we got him. That 15 health, man, it really comes in handy. I would say this is probably one of the better rocket launchers. Besides the fact, if you have a medic on you, I wouldn't say use it. Everything's really goofy on the server. I'm actually playing against human beings. That's, that's the kind of questions I ask myself. Because every time I see people taunting everything, I think it's some sort of glitch. If you all finish this up, I, just, I, don't, have, I don't have a whole lot left to go. Oh well. Um, so with Pyro's just, you know, you just me fuck up their timing, that's all you do. It's the easiest thing you can do. Ah, oh, try to get the medic. Wasn't gonna do much else with that. <laughs> it's just fucking... He's shooting at me, but I think there's... <laughs> it's all fucked up. 
Oh, what the I I play on the most ghetto of servers for some reason. I find this is you know it's better than having like a stupid ass message in in in, in, in between. Oh well. So yeah, pyros. I wouldn't I would not consider them to be a threat. They will get lucky. That's that's all they'll do. It's it really doesn't come down to a matter of skill. It comes down to a matter of luck. Uh, I'm sorry, uh, pyro fan base of the world. I saw you, Cloak, way back there. <laughs> he does like that weird face. And yeah, we're out of there. Pyro, reflect that, you fucking piece of shit. Oh, I got fucking wrecked. I was hoping to get an air shot in there, but no. Yeah, and that you know that that really goes with the difference here. Uh, you know, I'm gonna find a new server now. With that being said, so I'll be back in a minute. All right, we're back. Um, I found a new server. Thanks. Okay, so I was going over class of class versus class stuff. Yeah, you know, nothing in the pyro, nothing in the pyro's in, um, arsenal is really a threat except for the air blast. And the air blast, they, they can never do consistently. So if you just fuck up their timing, then you win every time, um, no matter what. I, I, I've never, I've never met, I've never seen a pyro or any kind of pyro video or footage or another pyro who was ever able to competently air blast. If they're good, it's probably because they mastered our extinguisher flare gun and all that kind of shit, and it's public server stuff, so it's kind of the way it works. Um, yeah, we're, we're going to go more into that in my power LP, trust me. Which is, you know, people are going to hate me. I, I have interesting opinions on pyros, what can I say? Uh, I guess Demo Man. Demo Man, I consider to be the counterpart uh, to the soldier. Uh, the soldier being a more direct uh, explosive class. Uh, and this class, um, the demo man is more of an indirect explosive class because the stickies are indirect, uh, the grenade launcher is indirect. You have to hit people straight on. Uh, opposed to me, I just have to aim for like something here and it just wrecks them on the building or whatever. Um, demos, uh, demos are arguably have more weapons at their disposal, but if you get up in a, in a demo's face, you will probably win. Uh, I don't think I'm going to be able to help out with that. And he's got that stupid phlogistonator thing, but he set me on fire and that killed me. Oh well. Also, I was trying to rocket jump my way out of there <laughs> while, while, getting, while, while getting out of there at the same time. Um, while getting him at the same time. I guess I'm going to actually equip a more standard rocket launcher. That's a, not, not a class I particularly play a lot, but uh, whatever. Actually, I want to get a half Satoshi kill. I really do. By the end of this video, I will have that. Uh, against heavies, um, the thing with heavies is heavies have a lot. Um, soldiers now have a lot of actual options against heavies. Not like they were ever a problem to begin with, but the direct hit absolutely fucking wrecks heavies. Uh, to, like it's more powerful against heavies. It's it's actually pretty ridiculous. They added that. Um, here's demo. My. Uh, Yeah, if you're Demo Knight, then, uh, whatever. Hey, Pyro. Just gonna reload all my rockets. It's, it's, a, it's nice of you not to actually try and engage me. So there he just tried to air blast me, as I said once again. The Heavy's actually probably the greater threat right now. Yes! <laughs> I got it. <laughs> um... Yeah, the, he the heavier was way more, way more threatening. But anyway, <laughs> anyways, uh, the heavies, yeah, uh, they've never been a problem because you can just kind of hop a corner and then you know you're good. And I, I can just spam people from long range. That's that's fine too. What the hell is oh something up there? Um, so yeah, so heavies, I, I, you know, obviously anything if you're in front of a spun up heavy. It's always going to be a problem. And I just, I just knocked that kid out. What the hell? Is there someone over there? What the fuck? Okay. I, my, my TF2 is like apparently Russian TF2 today. Uh, 
Yeah, he heavies are just like, yeah, whatever. Um, so yeah, spot up heavies you're gonna have trouble with. Uh, the next one, engineers, you counter sort of the sentry. You're not, a, you're not an official counter. This guy isn't even trying to air blast me. I'm to kind of, I'm, I'm kind of using my splash damage right now to kind of get them around the corner because I know they're there. There's a long reload time on the rocket launcher. Don't forget that. You got, you got to take that into account. And I got the, I got the medics, and so now they're not uh, charging Ubers anymore. Hey, Pyro. Um, engineers, yeah, they're not a threat to you. Uh, any way you put it, they can heal their sentries faster than you can, you can, uh, you can attack their, their stuff. Uh, so that's something valuable to take into account. Uh, but if you coordinate with another soldier or even a sniper, uh, you can actually take down the uh, even the level three sentry, which is actually kind of cool. Um, because it's just it, it is way too much DPS for them. I hate. Wow. I don't think I can take care of these guys. Well, you know, sniper's at close range. Come at me. Come on. Uh, well, now I can't put this thing away. Fuck. I will get pyro blood today. There we go. <laughs> I love this thing so much. I'm just trying to get onto this this cart right now. Victory. And we won! Yeah! There we go. Yeah, I wouldn't concern myself with enemies that much. Because, uh, yeah, you counter them. Direct, direct hits are actually more powerful than sentries. Uh, so that's something you can take along with you if you want to be a sentry killer. Uh, let's see, should we change our loadout at all? I don't know, I, I'm, kind of, I'm kind of enjoying this. Let's try a reserve shooter. Let's, let's try and get some mini crits in the air. Actually, let's use a standard rocket launcher instead, uh, just because we get a little bit of everything in. I have a bit of a cold right now. I don't know if you could tell. Anyways, um, and so uh, next up, medics. Medics are fun to kill because you know you don't counter them, but you can kind of rocket jump in there and kind of surprise medics because it just takes like one good rocket and either a shotgun blast or another rocket. You know, one good rocket deser deserves another. Um, you can kill them so effectively, and you are and and as for medics on your own team, you are their best friend. Uh, uh, pocketing, get, having a nice pocket medic. If you have a friend, you can get them to uh, pocket you. Uh, is also a lot of fun. And when, if they have the quick fix, they can follow you around. Um, basically, every kind of medic ability is great with with um, Ubering a, a soldier. It's just fantastic. Um, the only problem becomes with with uh, Uber is when you run out of ammo. So you have to make that ammo, ammo count. And that really counts for anything with the soldier. You know, you have to make every shot count. Okay, so I do see a, a there's a sentry there. Uh, I was trying to get the, I yeah you know, I I should have just killed him first. I don't know why I didn't. I tunnel vision. I'm sorry. Forgive me. And apparently this 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 sentry is just directly countering all of us. But um, but yeah. So so medics, yeah, medics are gonna be your bay. Uh, is well not gonna be your bane, but they 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 also heal their teammates a whole lot faster too. Oh come on, why can't why can't they get up here? I'm not gonna be able to hurt that guy. But just in there, seriously, why does any pyro fucking? Bring that along with them. Guess what? Now your medic dies. I can't aim those those three shots at all. Oh, I'm still gonna die. Oh wow, I didn't die. All right, all right. Let's just go bring this out. Uh, it's faster just to switch glasses than it is to actually like. Go to another class. Oh, for fuck's sake. Anyways, uh, so versus snipers. Uh, snipers, in a way, are a support class. You know, from long range, that is their strength. But you can easily close in the distance. 
That is one of your strengths as a class that you can just kind of rocket jump the fuck in there. Which is something I really like. Um, so, you know, as I said, if you play by their strengths, you're going to lose. If you're going to play by your own strengths, you're going to win. So the minute you go up to a sniper, you win. That's it. Um, especially if they have those that shield now. You know, I have to say one thing about the Phlogistonator Pyros is I'm so glad that they don't have their, their air blast. That, that might have actually been a problem. Oh. Uh, now he's dead. Oh, and now I'm dead. The soldier was a greater threat to me. He was just kind of raining death from above. And also height advantage for uh, soldiers, it means so much. Uh, and as for, uh, so yeah, snipers, yeah, you can play by their advantage and, you know, win every time. They don't really have much against you. Um, their tools are basically pretty universal, so, you know, they'll, e they'll either work flawlessly against you, or they, or they will basically just, they be they're meaningless to you. How's that guy not dead? Okay, that's, uh... Ah, oh, I'm dead. What the hell killed me that time? Where, where the hell were you even? Why were you over there? Oh, look, I found a beggar's bazooka. Sure, let's go use that. Why not? Fuck everything else. <laughs> let's use the retarded stuff. Um, and we're it looks like we're about to lose this anyways. So with spies, um, spies once again, same thing with any support class is, uh, you know, they have their strengths. If you find them, uh, they will lose. Um, and if you don't find them, obviously they'll backstab you. So you know, kind of like how if you don't. Please heal me, thank you. Mission ends in 30 seconds. You suck, sniper. I, I was an easy shot. <laughs> this thing's retarded. Oh god. <laughs> now I'm up here. That's great shit. So yeah, that's basically it for class versus class. It's a fun starting class if you want to get into combat classes. Kind of fuck up this entry if I try. Oh, he came back just at the wrong time. Oh, he got the sentry at least. Oh, whatever. I guess that's it for my soldier LP. I don't really have much else to say on this class. It, it is a class I'm not particularly great at, but you know, it's I find it fun all the same. If you want to get into a combat class, it's actually the perfect one to get into. So uh, that's pretty much it with with him and all his unlocks. So uh, yeah, I think I covered everything. So with that being said, uh, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. So see you later. Bye.